Hello all, Spontaneous Creations with Brian here. What I got in front of you is an 8x20 canvas. Um, I just did one of these a little while ago in white and turned out really nice I think. So I have to do one in black. Anyway, I'm doing a flip and drag. I'm using the Parage Posse paints. Got black so I'm going to use some metallics. Um, Parage Posse paint. This is Gold Rush. Oh, sorry if I'm holding it. Wait, that's upside down to you, huh? Gold Rush. I don't know. I'll hold them both ways. Again, Parage Posse Paint. This is Silver Spoon. Silver Spoon. Then we got Copper Penny. Copper Penny. And then we got Deep Lagoon. So, and I don't have a lot of that Deep Lagoon left in that bottle, so can't use too much. Um, the only difference between the last one and this one, I'm actually using a 2 ounce cup on this. I'm not going to fill it all the way up, but I wanted a little bit of a slide for the paint. So we're going to start with the silver. And I'm put a little bit of silver in there. A little bit more. I didn't want to start with the silver, did I? That was a mistake. Oh well. Put the gold in there. Put the Laguna in there, or the lagoon. See, there's not a lot of this lagoon in here at all. Lucky, I have another bottle of it. I have another full bottle of it. And the copper penny. And again with the silver. Gold. Lagoon. That's enough of that one, I guess. And then the copper penny. So I did use a, a, a bit more on this one than I did the last one. Not a lot more. Let's see how it works out. Swirl. Let's swirl this around a bit. Just a bit. Don't want it to do too much to so it gets muddy. Then we take our cup and we flip it over in the middle. And we take our needle, a little needle and a lighter. Get your needle up a little bit. And poke some holes in the bottom of your cup. Like so. The paint starts flowing out. I'm going to go this way with it. soon but hope I have enough color on there All the paint came out though. 
I sprayed that cup pretty good. But now it's got holes in the bottom, so can't like reuse it. I don't know, guys. We'll have to see what happens. Um, I'm going to hit it with a torch. Tilt it a little bit. a spot over here I'm worried about. I'll take some of this black. And do that right there. That'll work. Okay. Now I got my airbrush. I got my airbrush out. And we're gonna start blowing this, but Sorry if my hand's in the way and you can't see what I'm doing, but... The angle when you're blowing this gets kind of funky sometimes. Here. I like this, but I think I should blow this part out at least.
Oh, that wasn't good. So I just posted the white one, and uh, one of the questions was, does the paint self-level? And it does to an extent. It goes back flat to an extent, and it should dry flat. It's kind of all about the angle and the air pressure that you got on it. I did turn down my air pressure a bit on this, I think. I think I turned it the right way. I don't know if I want to do anything in here because it's already pretty wispy. I don't know if you can, how well you can see that right there. I will pick it up. I don't think I picked the last one up and moved it around. I don't know what to do with that there. Just totally get rid of it. that wasn't cooperating. There's something there that wasn't cooperating. But... Whatever that was, it's fixed. This one's very subtle. I like it. I like this one. It's, it's not the best one I've seen like this done, or with this technique, but... I like the colors. I really like this lagoon. This deep lagoon shimmer. Um, it's almost like a, where is it? I can't, see, I don't see the bottle right now. Here it is. It's close to a Verdean, but it's a little bluer, so I like it. Anyway, these here, are, the paints that I used are the Parage Posse paints. Uh, these are sold by Christina Welsh. She has a uh, YouTube channel, Christina Welsh Art. She also has a Facebook group, which is Parag the Parage Posse. Join the Parage Posse. Join her YouTube channel. Or get some paints from her. Um, Eight fifty for for a twelve ounce container. Uh, paint medium, silicone. Um, bottle and a little eraser cap. She puts these eraser caps on all of them. Uh, $8.50. She's got a set of 12 and a set of 4 metallics. Um, anyway, they're great. They're the perfect consistency. Uh, really love using them. I don't think I have much more to say about that right now. Uh, thanks for watching my video. Oh, I gotta pull it up and show you. See how close I can get in. So. I did not blow this area. At all. It came out pretty good. I should torch it one more time too. Because you never know if you're going to get anything when it... 
when you torch it or not. Definitely got to run my fingers under it because it's dripping. Just the black. Put a healthy uh, flood coat of black on there to start with. So it's going to take a while to dry. It's all right. Let me hit it with the big boy torch. that did did much no it's still cool looking as far as I'm concerned uh, again this has been Brian with spontaneous creations like share subscribe hit that bell just watch the next ones that I load up uh, thanks a lot have a good night